Hello, my name is Moses. As you can recall from last video, we talked about how to get place value of a number after a decimal point. So today we shall be talking about how to get the total value of a number after a decimal point. As you can remember, total value is the multiplication of a number by its place value. So in this unit, they can give you a question, for example. And then they tell you to find the place value of all the numbers after the decimal points. So, as you can remember, the place value here is tenths. Tenths is written this way. 0 0.1. So, that is tenths. So, if you want to get the total value of 9, you, you use the tenths and then you multiply by 9. Here yeah, 9, and don't forget your decimal point, you will get 0. So the, the total value of digit 9 is 0 0.9. When you come to 1, 1 is the hundreds, and hundreds is written this way 0 0.01. That is hundreds. So when they give you 1, you multiply by 1 so that you can get the total value of 1. Don't forget your decimal point. 0. So the total value of 1 is 0 0.01. Then you come to the last digit, which is 6. And 6 is in the thousands. And thousands is written to zero point zero zero one. That is thousands. Then you multiply the thousands by six. Multiply by six. So here you have six zero zero point zero. So the total value here is zero. Point zero zero. So they can give you a question, then they tell you to find the total value of a certain digit. For example, for example, they tell you to find five. So you come and write your question down here so that you can get enough space for working out. is different with the normal total value as the normal total value you only start from the right side but this one with the one that has the decimal point you only start from the right to the left hand side here you are going to have so if this, this the first one is in the tenths so tenths is 0 0.1 you multiply it by 6 6.0 0 0.6. Then you go to the second digit, which is the one that they have asked you, which is in the hundreds. So hundreds, 0 0.01 multiplied by 7. 7 0 0.0. 0. So 0 0.07. And your answer. Answer. 
is 0 0.07. So I hope you enjoyed the math video. Please like and subscribe so that you can not miss the next video. Stay tuned. See you next time and goodbye.